Hey folks, welcome to Performance Reviews, where I give you the review from the technician's point of view. And today, we have an unboxing of the SIBO E3. Now, the SIBO E3 is their premium compact canister offering that should suit most homes with both carpet and hard floor, and it comes with an electric nozzle. So let's open it up and see what's inside. Before we go any further, I just want to mention I'm going to put a link below to your local SIBO dealer where you can put in your zip code and find a dealer near you. All right. Oh. Greeted with a dusting brush. And the hose is just nicely wrapped around. You can just see it's very German in the package. Let's take it out. This is everything you get in the box. You get your canister, your electric carpet head, your hard floor tool, your dusting brush. This is an adapter to attach your dusting brush to your wand. You get a tapered hose, which means the hose is wider at the bottom of the canister than it is in the hand grip. What that means is the most constrictive place in the unit is right here. So if you were to suck up something you shouldn't, you could just reach in there and pull it out. This also helps increase airflow and performance. They also give you a manual and a warranty card. Again, the warranty is only valid if you buy it at an authorized dealer. So let's assemble it. It's really quick and painless. Hose just snaps right in there. Your wand snaps there. Save that. Then that just snaps on there. Now, if you want the dusting brush, You'll need to put this little guy on, like so. And then the dusting brush holder is just going to clip on right there. And your dusting brush is a multi-flexible tool. That all snaps right there. We're all assembled and good to go. I'd like to point out some hidden tools on this machine. There's also a crevice tool. And if you press right here, like so, you'll see the upholstery tool just pops in and out. Really slick. So you have your upholstery tool, your dusting brush, crevice tool, hard floor tool. Everything is right there. Really simple for you. There's also a parking space for the hard floor tool there as well. You have a place in the upright position for the parking tool there. The bumper on this machine is something that's very special. sibo has been doing for years. They call it the air belt. And what this is, is a fabric bumper with foam underneath to protect your furniture and the machine. This also is the air diffuser. So it's actually going to go like this and diffuse the air out of the machine. And it is normal for the air to be a little hot coming out of the machine. I wanna go over a tour of the controls on the E3. There are quite a few. So unlike the E2, this is just a power standby button. The actual machine is controlled right here at your fingertips. So you have adjustable suction at your fingertips, which is great. If you're doing a lot of dusting, something like that, this dusting brush does rotate at different angles. Nice soft bristles. The other thing on here that you should be aware of, this is a full bag check indicator. And this is either going to work when the floor tool is attached or there's no attachments. Don't try to get this accurate when you're doing upholstery or crevice tool or something like that. This is really just for when you're using it in its regular mode. You can see right there it turns orange. This works like the gas gauge in your car and it's a pressure gauge, which means if you get some big object stuck in the machine, it will also go off. There is a opening right here to get to the high filtration bag. Now for your warranty to be valid, you must buy genuine SIBO bags and they're reasonably priced. You can also get what I'm holding here, which is a service kit, which is eight bags plus the filters for the machine. So the idea is that this is about a year's worth of supplies in a 2000 square foot house. Moving on to the back side of the cleaner, you have soft 
rubber on the casters. This is going to be non-marring for your delicate floors. You have a parking space here for your hard floor. And then right here, you can see there's a compartment, thick sound deadening on there. And then in here, we have the exhaust filter right here. And what's cool about this is it's in a bag shape versus pleated. That makes this a little bit more eco-friendly and easier to manufacture. And that just tucks in right there. And when you put this cover on, you can just feel the quality of this machine. Now, I have an entire video on the ET1 Powerhead itself, if you really want to know the details of that. But we have one through four carpet height settings, and this is pretty much good for most types of carpet. Some of the denser soft carpet or higher pile carpet this does struggle with. Again, why you want to try this at your local dealer. There is a pedal release on the back, and if for some reason you slam it, you notice it released anyways and didn't break anything. And this shows Tocibo's commercial heritage. You also have an on-off button here, and this is your carpet hard floor button. Most companies put their carpet hard floor switch at your fingertips. They give you a button on the power head. It's kind of a quirk of the machine. You also have a nice soft bumper there. Again, there's non-marring wheels on here. You can shut this off and it is safe to use on hard floor. On the bottom side of the cleaner, you have a clean out door right there. Very nice. And then push this little button here and you can get to the brush roller really, really fast without any tools. So if you have a lot of long hair or you're just using it a lot, it's nice to be able to get to that to clean it. The brush roller is top rack dishwasher safe if you want to sanitize it. Let's see how much suction the E3 gets. So this gets about 41, 42 inches of working vacuum and about 65 inches of sealed vacuum. Now those numbers are really good. If you're not familiar with working vacuum, the closer the working vacuum is to the sealed vacuum, the better the airflow, which means the better the cleaning ability usually. So the sealed numbers are great, but like I said, these machines are known to have pretty high airflow and that shows that. So I'm really pleased with those numbers. So we've switched to the studio microphone. Let's see how loud the E3 is. Pretty good. Now we have a high noise level here at the shop right now, but you can see it's pretty quiet, if not one of the quietest machines on the market today, and certainly pleasant to use. So if you want to go vacuum and have a conversation, shouldn't be an issue with this one. Well, I hope that's answered all of your questions about the SIBO E3. If not, put your comments below in the comment box. If you have one, I'd love to hear from you as well. If you're looking to get one of these, I'll put a link to the SIBO dealer locator where you can find one locally. That is the best way to get this, and there are some perks to doing that as well. If you can't find one locally, I'll also have a link to where to purchase this online as well, and that will benefit the channel. So give this video a big thumbs up, and have yourself a wonderful day.